Good morning. It's another day. I'm alive. I hate to say it. On Garden Drive. All the shooting yesterday in the broad open daylight, pushing people out the house. And apparently the young man got mad. And he came back and was shooting. It that first somebody he saw on the dirt. So I woke up praying today I stay alive on Garden Drive. I love the ones who have reached out to me. I love the ones uh, who told me don't let nobody stop my motivation. I just want to say thank you, baby doll. I love you. I do. Because you did give me a little inspiration when I really was giving up hope. And you know how sometimes you just have to, they say let go and they go. So I let go and I let go. But at the end of the day, I can't stand when you walk to the store around here and me and pull up beside you, what you trying to do, bitch? You, I be want to say, bitch, you know who said pussy right here and who don't. Huh? I say, it's sad. And some of the shit that's walking around here looking like they about to pass the fuck out from being harassed. I pray today at me inside, I have a little peace. I have a little justice. And I'm going to keep to myself. And if I go get the money, I may walk to YB a liquor store and see if my drink that my daughter bought me was up there. Because I waited all day on a fresh bottle. And I didn't get it. I, I didn't get anything. But it's okay. Because I felt some type of way. But that's why I'm going to keep my ass in my house. Because I say, I don't care where I'm at on this street. They shooting up and down the street. They got cameras all around here. And the sad part, they're not thinking about... Cheer. It's cheering around here. These folk don't, these folk don't even care. Before they make these folk mad, they come back to shoot at them. What the folk got cheering around here? Okay? People trying to live. Okay? I mean, I cut off a lot of stuff because like my, my children say, I fuck with folk they don't even fuck with, so I stop fucking with folk. Especially when you don't mean me no good. Huh? And then I maybe I understand some some children is so fucking rude. Why would anybody give you anything with your nasty ass attitude? I ain't talking about nobody over 20 now before I get a thumbs down. Okay? When we was brought up, I, I mean, I've never seen so many children cuss. And they ain't junior, you ain't junior high school and you cussing? Hey, and then you act like you grown? Boy, I tell you, them going to be the ones either right. Them going to be the ones pregnant. Or then they talk about lesbian. They may be one. They tell, I mean, I've never heard so much derogatory stuff coming out of children. We just had a serious accident on South Lunker Road. I cried so I couldn't even go to sleep. Because God forbid if something happened to one of mine, I know I'm going to lose my mind. I done lost it before over my son. I done lost it before over my daughter. My daughter is my... My balance in life, not the Libra scale right now, because I used to confide in her a whole lot. And you have really disappointed me in life. I don't really care what you say about me, how you feel. I would never talk to you again. That's on our dead mothers. Dead mothers. Not alive mothers today. Dead mothers. But I don't wish no hurt, harm, or danger on you. Like you don't wish on everybody else. Why get all over the internet threatening folks? Why get on the internet telling these folk being ain't had shit to do with your ass? Now you and the other ones all over the internet saying how you feel. If a woman was with a man and you knew he had a woman, you sound kind of bitter. You're not the only one better yet. When you when you took him from somebody else this late, was she complaining? No, now all of a sudden she done hopped back alive on youtube you got 60 million dollars when you went to texas to shut the fuck up that be back talking a goddamn game i tell i'm trying to figure out ptsd don't get triggered from no goddamn divorce if you was gonna be triggered from a goddamn ptsd and somebody married that shit i, I should be ptsd like a motherfucker when mine took seven thousand dollars do you understand how phil took my house took my furniture changed the locks so happy he didn't know he didn't change the side lock so when I went in there, hello, Miss J Mr. Johnson, this is Miss Valentine. I knew he was cheap. You know what I did? Pouring every piece of salt. I didn't pawn it. I sold the shit. And I got me somewhere to fucking stay. Next thing I know, two weeks later, he up there checking the car. Like, I don't know how to check a fucking car. My One thing about Bishop W.C. Alexander. 
a tabernacle of faith in Detroit, Michigan. Gang, gang. He raised no weak one. Because he said my problem was with a man, they ain't going to be able to handle the truth that comes with me. Because I don't depend on no goddamn man. Because at the end of the day, you already know a man can get out there and sleep with several different women in the street. But ain't nothing going to happen to them. But at the end of the day, we'll get talked about. Shout outs to the people out here in Columbus, Georgia, all over the world. This street that was like Crenshaw yesterday. That's why I had to call my sister. I know behavior. Because I felt some type of way yesterday, sis. I ain't going to lie. Especially when I heard somebody lie. You lied, girl. You lied. You lied. You lied. You lied. You lie. I'm just not gonna talk about it right now. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to keep my pretty ass at home, huh? That part. When they say, "Damn, you losing a lot of weight." These bitches titties way out here. I want to tell her, baby, your man. Your man was saying that when he was trying to holler at me on Hood Street. I'm glad I didn't talk to him after I seen what he was with. I ain't got it. I, I ain't even go on the shapes today. BMWs. I'm gonna be nice today. The BMW. Don't get mad. Cut dirty red. Still fine. And I'm gonna stay fine. To the day I die. When she says she ain't know how to throw up gang sign, I hope I'm throwing up fast enough for you now because he ain't here to help you. Because I will never respect what you did. Never. Never, ever, ever. I don't care what you say. Nothing but God prayers will keep me from watching you be destroyed upon this earth today. Upon this rock, I build a revelation. That's sad when you don't like family members. It's real sad. 